There is that cause boys that keep selling you e apa ka apa. Then because she left, then I was like, hey, I was afraid to be left alone there. So I followed her. To catch up your corner. Kapata na wanome one day. Thugs. Four. Needless to say, I got raped. I remember telling one of those rapists, fanya hivi. Kambia chukua mawe. Oni gonge hapa continuous ni mpaka ni kufe juu sezi. Kasi ma, ah, nye hata mtakuwa mademu wetu nyinyi. For five years, on and off, I dated this man. Because he used to have domestic violence, <laughs> emotional abuse, financial abuse. But the day I said, ah, 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 pana, taniua. He almost threw me off the balcony, fifth floor, to Kishi Pango. The auditions, the last two people for that role was me and Lupita Nyongo. Either one will get this role. Nilikuwa Mombasa na Jivinjari, I got that role. Hey, yeah, that's when I made my first million. What's the importance of having a spouse that supports your art? There's nothing as good as having that support system from your spouse. When You know the job that I do is in the limelight. Yes. Most men would not be happy about that. He says, keep going. Keep going. Hello and a warm welcome to LNS. My name is Lynn Googie and guys, I'm just going to give you a disclaimer right now. In today's conversation, please be prepared to laugh and laugh and laugh. My guest is incredible. She has been through a couple of things. She's what I would call a legendary in the industry. Guys, this woman, I'm telling you, she's such a free spirit. She's about to walk us through her life. That is her acting life, her relationships, losing love, finding love, losing love, finding love, and why we should not even think of giving up matters love, and also to talk to us about why consistency, discipline, and all the things that lead us to success are important. I'm about to let her introduce herself. But before that, guys, if you are watching this episode and you have not subscribed to our channel, you are doing a great disservice to this work. Please go and subscribe. Hit the notification button on also so that you do not get to miss on any of our wonderful episodes. Okay, si java elegance leo, but you know the shoes easy via to by day to nafa to zite via to zailenen. My team says they are tired of me wearing these shoes, but I I love them and they are comfortable. So if you can afford a pair or two, check their contact details right here. And now without further ado, please allow me to let my guest today introduce herself. Good. <laughs> 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 You, you make me lose my mojo, Bala. <laughs> good. How are you? I am good. Yes, I me am too. I'm good. Yes. My name is Lydia yeah. Nyambura Gitashu. You know you are my namesake. Are they? Oh. Nyambura. You're a Nyambura? Yeah. No, oh, why? Nyambura has been so hardworking. We don't take jokes. Hey. Eh? <laughs> we don't... Hey. We don't, we, we don't play around. Imagine. Yeah, that's yeah. how I like it. That's how you like that's it. That's how I like it. <laughs> I like work. Go. Work, work, work. As long as it has... Kuna work and then there is a you know the pay. Yes. Uh once they merge, yeah. Give me whatever you need. We are good, we are good, we are to, good go. to go. All we, right. As long as it's legal. Yes. Yeah. 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 Yes. So I'm Lydia. Yeah. I am a creative entrepreneur. Yeah. When I went for a workshop somewhere. Yeah. No, don't call yourself an actor, female actor. You're a creative entrepreneur because you have you've been on stage, you've been on TV, you've been on film, you've done commercials, you direct. So you're a creative entrepreneur. Is a sort of ile kitu siyafanya ni billboard. Oh, eh, wh why? Because eh, most people used to tell me my skin color it doesn't deserve to be on a billboard. Are you kidding me? Right I'm now? not kidding you. It's a thing. Haya. <laughs> that your skin color what? Eh, too dark. Oh man. Yeah, there's some roles I've not get yes. because I'm too dark. But I'm so talented. The problem is they can't the, the, color. Ile ina tuzia product. Yes. It has to be. Unaona hii? Yeah. Rangi ya thao? Yeah. That's the one. This is what they prefer? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Now, what do they, what are you telling them? Or what are they saying when they see you here? I keep thriving. Eh, yeah. Uh, because nice. hakuna mtu alijiumba kwa hii dunia. There you go. As long as you have the discipline, you have the talent, lafu, you keep pushing. 
Yes. Don't wait for anybody to come and push for you. You keep pushing through all those blocks. Yes. And I'm still thriving. Okay. Yes, ma'am. Ma yes, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> you are such a vibe. I love I good energy. I, I swear to, like, honestly, yeah. I, after I t just told you we had such a crazy production week, and yes. today is our last day yes. of filming a couple of episodes before maybe we go to next week. Mm -hmm. So I, I've just been really down. See, down at mm. him. But then now it's like God just sent you to Nifunge Week in a style, man. Yes, I appreciate in a style. I, it's a full ride. It, eh? It's a full ride. Yeah, so you finished the week with mm. Mm. With mm. There we I, go. I appreciate you. And I appreciate you too. Yes. And okay, then, you're so full of energy as well. Oh. It's good energy. I <laughs> know it's a Nyambura thing. I, uh, keep forgetting. I have to keep reminding myself. It's a Nyambura thing. It's a Nyambura thing. So, yes. Yes. So, mm. this girl mm. uh, was born in Thika. Me, a medical. Yeah. medical hospital. Thika Medical Hospital. Okay. So it's a level four or something. Yeah. Uh, that is about 45 years ago. I'm 45 years old. Me, I don't hide my age. I don't hide my age. Yeah. That's how long I've been on this earth. Yes. So I get born and then my mom takes me to Loitoktok. That's where she, she lives mm -hmm. up to date. Mm -hmm. And after one and a half years, she brings me to my grandparents and she leaves me there. Because Anajua, she'll get a better life here. Oh. And so I grew up with my grandparents in Katanga, and Pareto Mafada. Mm. At, me in Wamuranga. Yeah. It's not just the name, it's also where I come from. Hard working double twice to the power of one million times, dedicated to everything else. I don't know how to describe it. I'm from Moranga too. Let's keep Chigli going. Yow sito, <laughs> yow sito. Hey! There's too much in common here. Yes. So you see? Niko Katanga. Yeah. So I, I grew up around, uh, my grandpa had uh, three wives. So there was a lot of step uncles and aunties and stuff. And uh, the thing that I never really, really got was the parental love. Because my grandparents had all this, their own children, and then their children's children. I have two other brothers who to the mm. my grandparents mm -hmm. together. Mm. So when I was very young, I started wetting the bed because there was something lacking. And Lynn, I wet the bed until when I was in form three, okay? Let's, let's get that out of the system. I hear you, man. Uh, from when I was young to until when I was in form three. Because the, the things that I went through as I was growing up, numerous things, I, maybe I should go touching, 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 because mm. we have a lot to cover, yes, right? Yes, yes. So when I was, um, when my, my mom, my grandma had two kids, my mom and her sister, my aunt. My aunt used to live in Thika Town. Yeah. So because her two last boy, boys were bedwetters, nili ambiwa, uh, sasa wewe, toka kwa show show na mnukishia mba. Kuja ukai na sisi, so that you can all wet the bed together with my last born two boys. Mm. So I used to sleep with boys. Mm. It was triple deck. Okay. Sisi wale wakojua ni uko chini. I want you to understand yes. that I've come from far. Yeah. Na pale naenda badu hata sijisiko halfway. Chia wiko. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ndiyo mimi uyo. Naenda ni meanza kuishi uko. Nikafanya primary. Wetting the bed, wetting the bed. Yani it's, it was like a religion. This is something you do every day, okay? Because there was a block in my mind. Yes. Sometimes you don't understand why are you wetting the bed. And, and I would like to encourage somebody if we came in from three. But I used to say I'll never get married. Mm. Who is going to marry Akiko Josie? But I'll tell you what happened when I was in from three. Yes. So anyway, I grew up with a lot of uh, hardships. That home was uh, my uncle in that home was an alcoholic. But me nilikuwa nampenda. Can I tell you why I used to mm -hmm. love him? Mm -hmm. Imagine. Hakuwa na nichagua tuwe si wangu. So uwe peke yako ndo nda kufukuza kwa hii nyumba. He used to kufukuza as any time he feels like. Oh my God. Eh, Mimi kwa na msiki angatua na huko. Huko ni kwangu. Wa jinka nyinyi. Tokeni. So we would sort of simba na kuja. Mm. So you know what I used to grab? Mm. I used to grab the ugali. Uh, somebody else grabs. Because it's a lot of injured. Yes. But I loved him because he didn't chagua me. Now my aunt on the other side. Ah uh, yeah. That was a different story altogether. We are trying to mend a relationship yeah. now, but she had a specific mshipi for Lydia. Nikipita mtihani, because I was, I was smart in school, even in primary school. Nikipita mtihani, na watatuwaki wajapita, and I pretend, sacha nyinyi muna angukare, na wewe mbona usaidi yangi watoto wangu pia wa pita exam, you know? I was, I was the target. Oh, yeah. And the, <laughs> the one I remember the most when I was young, the, the first one in that family, my cousin, she gave birth to her child when she was really young, in form two. Mm -hmm. So, Mimi, class six, class seven, I'm not sure, uh, upper primary. Mm. 
So it was on a Saturday. Ni memaliza duty zangu. I, I, I was I, I work in that house. Thank mm-hmm. God I'm a Nyambura because mm-hmm. I, I used to work hard. Kuwasha yes. nguo, unene nini? Kitu siko na alio kufanya ni kupika. Uh-huh. For Usiweka whatever reason ni mingi. Eh, yeah, ama nisi nisichome nyumba uh, or something. Yes. Lakini like, you no know, I used to observe wakipika. So nikasema, ah, tume hii ni saa 2. Hakuna mtu amekuja kutuangalia. Two children in the house I was like, wacha nipike mkorogo. Najua ile pancakes. Mm. And it mix and it mix. It was it mkorogo chap. It mm. utapo. Mm. Ni ka mix ni ka mix kwanza ilikuwa inatoka shape saba vile inaenda ilikuwa inaka <laughs> every all over kaki na tu hivi mimi na kama my kindness mm. she was about uh, what a year or something old mm. tunakula nikienda kuninia pili hivi mama ya huyu mtoto akaingia my cousin <laughs> unaona hiyo moidori ya trolling pin yes. <gasps> lin Nilipigwa continuously as if I'm not human. Ushaipigwa mpaka una dry au una kaa hivi just go ahead. Niko mbefura kila mahali. Nilisa already. Yes. They had to take me to hospital. Siku enda shule for a couple of days. Zuri kwa mtoto unapona haraka. So once when that happened something shifted in me. Mm. Nikakuwa na self esteem issues. Nikakuwa very aloof. I was never that free to play the way I used to want I really become aloof. Then one day for me to go back to my grandmother's place Shosho alikuwa anakujanga kwa shop. They had a, my auntie and my grandpa mm. had a shop in the same kwa market ya Thika. Mm-hmm. So she would come. But then one day there's another one I will not go into because yes. even my 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 cousin, mm. the second born, mm. she used to sexually molest me. Mm. Yeah? Hiyo nyumba. There's no from the first born to the last born. Only the last born didn't do anything that I as a really stick in my mind. But anyway, here I am. Nimetumwa na the second born niende kwa shop huko kwa soko mm. nichukue vitu za kupika mm-hmm. then who do i find my grandma she had come to bring her, her produce to sell at the market mm. so she was still around now, like so I, i i go into the shop and i see her and she can tell something, something is wrong okay. with this child so she tells me come i'm like i look at my aunt and like she goes into the car they had a, a pickup mm. she goes into the car and she tells me come here So I go in. She just asked me one question then. Like Kiru, what's wrong? I didn't answer, my tears answered because now I found somebody who is actually caring enough to ask me, how are you? Nobody used to ask me how are you. Where end of any that. Because even in school you're told sit down, do it's following mm, orders. Mm. But nobody had taken the time to ask me how are you. Where? <laughs> Niliambiwa enda uchukue vitu zako tunarudi katanga leo. Mm. I ran. I ran like wachana na you Saint Bolt. I think I ran double twice. Yes. I got hope. I didn't even care. She, so my cousin is asking me where are the things? I'm going. I'm going. Bye. I'm going. I packed my three things. Yes. Sisi hata nilikuwa na ndugu yangu ngoko. So I packed my three things very quickly, <laughs> ran back and that's how I went back to my grandma. Yeah. And that's now a bit of my younger child because I went oh, yeah. to Kobothai girls yes. in high school. And high school I was you know the way first of all I don't look like a kikuyu no so my sense of humor kicked in full gear cuz what are you going to say at you like kikuyu yeah yeah i know like i look like i look like a luo but yeah i'm kikuyu no na ji chekele ya kabla ni chekele so that i have i have yani water yeah. down anything you wanted to say See. I've already laughed at myself yes. what more do you want oh, yeah. but then don't forget i was still wetting the bed so that there was a chip on my shoulder so for me to to feel hata kama mimi nichopi kwa shule for me to feel i'm still i'm still somebody hata kama ni nakojoa na, kwa kitanda nina pass exams nina there's a, a teacher my CRE teacher she used to call acha ni sawe jina yake yes. akia a teacher yeah. CRE was my best subject yeah. so there's a time she came to class i, I can't get up and demonstrate but yes. you'll get the picture uh-huh. so akakuja kwa class akasema good morning she used to walk like she had this walk hey is that right? Yeah, I love you. <laughs> so she walks in. <laughs> Then I kasa ma, "Good morning, class." Okay, can I have the nini? So so and so. Okay, today we are going to learn about the disciples of Jesus. As I mean, kwa chopi. So who can tell us one of the disciples of Jesus? Eh. Na pick mkono and I used to sit up and bela and we we urajua. So there was a chick that was called Gillian. Yes, Gillian. Oh, Gillian. Gillian. Oh, she she used to speak like that. I loved her. <laughs> yes, Gillian. Gillian says, "Enoch." <laughs> you know, I bought some of 
Mimi nilikuwa na wakati huko chini. I was like, "Pui pui pui." Enoch made it to the list. <laughs> Imagine. Jillian opens her mouth and says, "Enoch." This she was like, she started hyperventilating. She was like, "Did you just somebody else?" No. Ah! Oh. Mwalimu alisema, "What? Which Sunday schools did you?" She started screaming, "Can you kneel down all of you and light up your hands?" At the end of, she took her books. She left. Me I was left. I was I laughed. I was like, "Are you guys serious? Were you trying to joke or something?" Enoch, Noah, disciples of Jesus. Na kaenda class na kasema, "Ah, we kneel down the whole yani some moments in school." So what I did, once she left, I got up and started meditating. <laughs> <laughs> Then I became so popular. But what, you know that has been what you forget to ramba kikochozi. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was in form two. Now let me tell you. In form three, first time, this same teacher, she was our guidance and counseling teacher. She calls me to her office, and I'm like, but I got an in here. Why is she calling me to her office? Calling me because I'm happy. Unani na zile za. Hey, I'm an unpatia kapeza. You know you're very conflicted. Yes. What's happening here? Yes, yes. So when you come here to office, I can be like, ah, sit down, get tasho, come get tasho. Ah, I want to know. You're doing very well in class, but what? How are you? How are things at home? How is your mom? Oh. You remember the same way grandmother asked me, "How are you?" I started. Uh, my mom, me, I have my grandma. Oh yeah, uh, 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 and my life story. Lynn, from that night, I stopped wetting the bed. Oh, oh gone. All you needed was, was someone, someone to unlock all this stuff that was in my head. You know now you you and you, given, you become somebody else given it's a teacher yeah nilifungua roho nikaongea 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 ikatoka ikaisha ah and then she was transferred to another school oh. but she i think that was she was there for that particular for purpose you, for, for me for that particular reason because once that happened yeah. i started thriving in class yes. i started walking taller i started laughing better confidence honestly confidence As, and then I, in my mind i was like ah now i can get married Yeah. And it stopped never again. So me I would advise people that if especially when I used to go and do motivational uh, talks in high school yes. with my fellow Tahiti high actors. Yes. And I would tell my story. And you should see the number of people the students who used to come after the nini and they mm. tell me I am a bad waiter. How could I do? And I said just do exactly what I did. The stuff that you you have locked and it just it's mental it's kukojoka kitanda mtu akafa from 3 is not normal it's mental so go and talk and then something will click something in your brain will, and you'll have lot uta let loose some toxins yes, yes. and that's mm. how i stopped nikaenda form 4 yeah nikapita mtihani vizuri sana eh yeah. kama thai guys niko na record uko i was very smart but nili miss one point kwenda uh, university i got a b minus yes. it's 1995 people So I got a B minus ni kamis point moja. And because I didn't have people at watu watakuja wani wani tetee niingie ama nilipiwe private university. I wanted yes. to go to mass communications. Yeah. And people would have helped me but uh when ni mtoto wa shoshwe. So nika nika ka home. Gatanga nikarudi katanga helping my grandparents nini nini. Then nilikuwa na tabia mbaya. Sundays nilikuwa najifichanga naenda inaitwa ilikuwa inaitwa nini? What was it called? Jam session. Pale, there's a club called Vibes Club in Thika. And the dance ee wale matupak dear mama nini ni zenge kwa na rock nzo. Unge ni pale and I was very good. Where? Hapa, hapa. How are you dancing to dear mama? Haya. Mtu paka kisema dear mama. Take you you. You don't know these things. <laughs> When I was young, my mama had me 17 years old kicked out on the street. The back of the day I never thought I'd see her face in a woman alive that could take my mama's place. I love hapo kwa mama anasema grandmas cuz my day ni sikujui. Yeah. Ah yeah. Say komoda. Then I, I I used to go like it's Sunday. Sunday nikimaliza church, naenda home na pikia shoshi na vuka na jificha. Naenda vibe star hapo Thika Town. Yeah. yeah. We are going somewhere serious. We are, we are going. We are going somewhere serious. So siku moja, imagine one day and this is advice I'll give you. If your parent or your sorry, if your parent or your guardian tells you 
Uh, na leo mahali unaendanga sitaki uende. Chini u, where you used to go? Usidhani unaficha mtu kitu. Mm. Chini u, uya naendanga mahali mm -hmm. every Sunday. Akimaliza ni mbiyo mbiyo, amevaa tule tu long skirts, uh, long skirts, kachek, I can remember how you used to dress. Anajificha, so akaniambia leo ni kona wageni sitaki uende. Yeah. Usha yona teenager amenuna. <laughs> na nilijificha na nikaenda. Uwe! <laughs> Uwe, skiza parentu wako, ni kama na try kukuambia something is going to happen. That night when I was going back home from Vibestar, we got kidnapped me and another chick. Tulirushwa ndani ya gari fulani, tukapele kwa wuu, Nairobi, that time me was Gino, Nairobi. Thika was the best town I knew. And Kiambu when I was going to, I mean, Komothai when I was going to school. Tumepele kwa, what is K1? We don't know what that is. So me and this chick, and then my grandmother had told me always, when you're going somewhere, always have your tupesa tuwako. So nikuwa nimejifichia so mbili hapa kwa braba. So, tumefikiri huko. Wamenunua, I remember they bought reds. That kind of pombe. So, nika signal this chick, we signaled each other, we go to the toilet. So we went to the toilet, tuka jificha, and then we said, nika mwini, sasa huku tuko hapi, unajua tuko hapi, kasama, eh, unajua tuko hapi, tatembea turudi tao. Imagine we walked, uhuru, this is 1998. Two girls, watu watika, tulitembea, tulitembea, saa tukafika, na tukafika tao. This is Nairobi City. Tulipofika, eh, akaniambia, tuende, uh, uh, no, we walked until where the matatu za thika zilikuwa. Sasa ni sane usiku. Kitambo, they used to close shop, so wadi. But sambili, that last week was left. Then, apo, tu karibu, tu kasikia, umo, umo, ten bob, umo, ilikuwa ten bob. So, first of all, this girl has nothing in her pocket. Me, I knew, kuna kakitu ni mefita. Ten bob, umo, kaniambia, ah, niko nanti anaishi umo, tutaenda kwake. And come eh, eh, for real, eh, twende. So, so you know you're still looking for safety. You know sometimes you, if you went back, you would wish that I wish to get a club, to get a New York somewhere there. But now we decided we want safety, we want to sleep. At just where kulala inje, ukaenda umo. The house she went to knock. To the uncle Levi. Nataka nini? Nini nani? Hambi ukusiko. Oh, okay. So we we try to tell them. Sometimes we put our money back kulala. Mulango lefungo in our faces. So now so we start walking. Then I saw some kiosks. Mm. I told her we can get into one of these. And then we wait until morning. Mm. Then we leave. Then she was like, ah, ni mekumbuka ata ni yapa. Runa kifika pala tuchapa hivi. Ni yapo hivyo. I told her, no, let's say, <laughs> follow your instincts. There's that voice that keeps telling you, i yapa, ka hapa. Then because she left, no, I was like, hey, I was afraid to be left alone there. So I followed her. Tukachapa hiyo kona. Kapata na wanome wane. Thugs. Four. Needless to say, I got raped that night. We got raped. Over and over. A virgin imechukuliwa. I remember telling one of those rapists, Fanya Ivi, just take mawe, moja. Because I was thinking, am I going to go to my grandmother's soil like this? She told me not to leave the house yesterday. Kambia chukua mawe. Oni gonge hapa continuous ni paka ni kufe juusezi. Kasima, ah, nye hata mtakuwa mademu wetu nyinyi. That time, my spirit is dead. I'm, I'm, I'm ready to die. Then they took, uh, once they were done, waka tupeleka koma three, waka tuambia, uh, waliko menibia ile sombili, waka niambia, ah, shika ido. Alafu mtupatia phone number, tu apigia simu, juka mlifika. Me, I'm just like a robot, I'm like, whatever, whatever. I just want to go back home. I just want to go back home. So on the journey home, you're thinking, oh my God, oh my God. So I didn't want to go to my grandmother's place straight. Nikaenda kwa antiangu, ule, ule. I told her what had happened. And for the first time, she cried real tears. She was like, she's the one who took me to my grandma's. And we told her what happened. And my grandmother told me, don't worry. That was the time of HIV. Mm -hmm. I thought I was going to get pregnant. You know, you're scared of all this stuff that's going to happen. So, Akaniambia, don't worry. We prayed. She told me, you'll be fine. You will not get HIV. You will not get pregnant. But that's how I was going to get for real. And that's exactly what I did. You remember, you went to church, the real church. Katanga Catholic Parish. <coughs> Where? <coughs> Nani kaingia youth, na tukanza kufanya plays. And I became very stunned, very committed. Before that, I was not very committed. And during those uh, rehearsals of plays, they invited guys from the National Theatre. So, and then I cornered one of them and asked me, how, how do I come to the National Theatre? And she told me, ah, you just take a matatu, come to the theatre, kuna kwanga na auditions, whatever, whatever. I did exactly that. Once we finished the play, we were number one uh, uh, play. Yes. Uh, we are Katanga Catholic. So now I'm starting to get back my energy. I had to heal. Because so many times I thought about committing suicide. 
along my life as I was growing. Eh, hey, mara mingi nilikuwa nataka commit suicide. So then I decided no. I need to be, I need to live. Na nikaingia, nikakuja National Theater. Nilipewa so mbili na shosho yangu, imagine nikuja ni hustle. Wacha niingie National Theater. Eh, hey, mafisi sako. Kule ni mafisi sako. Munda danganyo kuna shows. The first I used to do set books. Yes. So to me audition mm. and then kumbe sisi atutafanya hiyo play theater itakuwa ya ku travel. Jesus mwega. Woi. Mali to dianzia hii career. So tuna rehearsia um, career call. <coughs> there is a nini there? There is a hall. Yes. Akoko hii si rehearsal. Asemka. This place set books nimezifanya. <laughs> tulikuwa tulikuwa na group tulikuwa naitwa Visions. Yes. I know this is how to to me has to me iva tunaungua. We just now need students to Entertain. perform for them. To perform for them, yeah. eh? Mkambiwa, eh, tume market wapi? Tukafanya shule mbili kadha. Hamlipwi? Hii ndio bafu chafu. Inatangwa bafu chafu. Yes. Hamlipu mnambua. Now this money we are keeping it for when we travel to Kisumu. That was the main thing. So, natuambua, yeah, the shows are ready. Uh, to, to, first of all, to tain, tulienda wapi? Tulienda kis, no, kericho. Kuna shows na wangoja kericho. So we were told, go, pack, ready to leave for about a month. You won't go back home. Ah, my excited. Wacha tuende kiricho. Hakuna show. Naenda kwa shule mambo. Who are you? What are you doing here? No, we were told there's a show here. Nobody has told us about a show. Sasa ni muanze kuhaso. Going to schools to market. Remember you spent a month in something. Rehearsing. Yes. Because you ume, ume kausha shosho wako mpaka ame, ame sota. Ame, mm. Kila siku 200. Mm. 200. <laughs> you almost want to give up. We struggled. That is the first time I had traveled with theater. Mm. Set books. Tukatoka hapo kericho, tukapata kashule kamoja. Kakatulipa, I think, 7,000. That time it was not bad money. Yes. About, this is 2,000. Yeah. The year 2,000. Nulipa kama 7,000. Tukasema, juu kuna shows kisumu. The same people who are lying to us. Anasema, juu kuna shows, kuna shule zina tungoja. Zimeja hivi kisumu. Wacha tutumia hii pesa tuende kisumu. So that then we, when we come back, we come back with good money. Wacha yes. tuende. Nobody has marketed. Kuna shule inajua munaenda. Unajua tuliko tunalala kwa kanisa ya mtu. 14 people. <laughs> I don't know, but mtu wakipinduka mnapinduka nyi wate hivu. Mm. Ukisikia mtu wame, uuu, mnapinduka hivu. Because we were all tandazo out on the floor. Yeah. Thank God for that pastor. Then we got one school. Yeah. We just said, he, we are going back home. We can't be marketing. Mm. We don't know how to do marketing. We are mm. too young. Mm. Wacha nilirudi home. Unajua nilienda, when I was living, I was very nice, very smooth. Nilirudi nyole kika hivi, afro. Hakuna mtu wakukunini. Una, ya, unachana, Yes. Na yes. <laughs> because there's no money. Who's taking you to the salon? Nothing. You've not made any money. Nothing. So I go back home and my grandma asks me, well, are you sure this is what you want to do in life? Come here. Nika kaka home to reorganize myself. Then I said, yeah. Narudi yo theater tena. Ke, miambili. Karudi theater. Then nika fanya audition for a play that was being done at the National Theater. And that one was a sure bet. I made my first 6,000 shillings. My friend, let me tell you what I did. Niliena nikafanya shopping. And then a friend of mine called Monica. Monica, thank you so much. Alikuwa naishi baba dogo, kaniambia, wee badilanga kuenda ngadini all the time. So you see, I've saved fuel. I mean, I've saved not fuel. Now that we are driving, we talk fuel. Fair. Fair. Watch out, we're honest. Fair. You may save fair. 200 bob. You may save fuel. Fair. So wakati nilikusanya pesa yote hivi. Nilifanya shopping. Nilikuwa na nawa kionoli kianguka. Nikapelekea shushu. And then she was like, ah, finally. Something. And then from there. 2002, that was the defining year of my career. There was a play called The Burdens by, um, it's a you, Uganda. Yes. It was National Theatre. That time now, my name is, is an actor for set books. It was grow. Okay. People were like, she's disciplined. Mm. You, she's you could tell, yeah, she's hardworking. Yes. She comes on time. She, she has delivers. her lines. She delivers. In fact, there are schools that were saying, is Lydia going to be on, mm. on stage? Yes. So they were told, I'm doing Tinker. Burdens, it was a four character. Nene. So the producers I was with uh, to negotiate, because me and you have any lipe ile pesa na deserve. Yes. So they told me, I will pay you 700. I was like, no, why not a G, Pasho? And they were like, ah, what will happen? Once you fix, if you see a full house, mm. the first time mm. you see a full house, could you teach it out? Okay. I was like, okay, okay. The first day, full house, mpaka watu wanakaa uku katikati kwa stairs. Plastic sticks were brought. That's a G. Kumbeja, inafaa kuwa a G. Kasema, Acha tu nyamazi elewa, sioni kama niko na tamaa ya pesa. Mm -hmm. Ah, yusha ta ningeitisha tu anyway. Yes. But, 
So nikangoja. The next day it was even more complicated. Karibu watu wakae mpaka nje. Lydia Kidatu is on se- on stage doing uh, t- uh, tinker. tinker. The burdens. Mm. Kukaja so the second day after tumemaliza I went to the producer and Kambia. Sasa si tuliongea nikiona tu full house. Sasa kutoka jana simekuwa full house. Yes. Remember ah wewe kitashu na kuangana issues. Sasa sasa sa, ni nini? Si hata ungegoja that show was going to run for only a week and a half. So why should I wait for a week to end for me to come and tell you what you said you will do? Kambia we end home to that time I had could go to let simu. That's when the nenis had come. We end home to take pigia 2002. And then there's an audition that had happened when I was in the theater for a TV commercial. So mimi nilienda nikiingia tu nikasema Hello how are you? Mzungu fulani anaitwa Guy Wilson. Who are you? I'm Lydia. You want to audition? Yeah, nika audition. Unajua he was shocked with like Are you that good? Unajua but the, sometimes you, you're in doubt. Unasema kwa roho yako I think I impressed that guy. Yes. But then you tell me nika enda home. Yeah. Then that night when nikaenda hiyo time nilikuwa naishi na kazi yangu somewhere in Mushaba huko yes. nikaanza kujiuliza am i in the right career because i was called by the producer kaniambia fanya hivi tumeku replace usikuje kesho i was replaced so i sat down and asked god am i in the right career because since i was a child when i was watching those non but and whatever i knew this is what i want to do should, I, i loved account so nikajuza should i go and now do accounting mm. study kuweka simu tu chini hivi kwanza kujiuliza maswali napata phone call nyingine hello is this lady gitashu uh, could you come back to the theater you were shortlisted for the commercial ungo nafunga kaka mrango nene nafungua dirisha inatoka hapa inaenda mpaka timpak 2 and beyond yes 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 i can come tomorrow what time eh yeah, nitakuwa kaenda theater sasa ma producer wa niona njo si utu nimwambia sikuje i was like ni siko shughuli yenu mungu amefungua ka window mahali nikataa nikaenda Then I auditioned again they said ah yeah you got the role so uh, we we'll be shooting so you need I was paid my first 28000 2002 TV commercial ni kwaya always pads nikahama huko kwa mshadha nikatafuta kanyumba isli na 28 nilifanya vitu vingi nikatafuta ka room nikanunua mattress nikaweka kwa ground nikanunua ka TV because I need to keep nini working on my craft nikanunua ka meko na nikafanya shopping at least one month twende kazi twende kazi that same year kuna play ilikuja we auditioned at phoenix ni kind of phoenix ni audition ni the the next play that's coming up but then somebody fired me you hata not well ina ina kasidisha ina sidishanga sana <laughs> but today we work with that same guy yeah. who ni ni because I aliona ah uh-huh. I made a mistake there yes. I made a mistake yeah. but now we are good okay. then there was an audition that happened at phoenix for a play a mzungu lady and Kajitan Kajitan wrote that yes, play Kajitan yes. boys called yeah. um it was called Winds of Change mm-hmm. I was given the main character to record na lipo 4000 shillings uh, per week allowance play unapewa allowance ya kurihas and then we went and recorded in a studio i was paid 20000 my friend you know life that no so so wadi yaka kuno any time i used to just go and see my grandparents any time pesa i just and then the art of saving nilikuwa na saving nasema hii ni hapa hii ni hapa hii ni hapa hii ni hapa discipline ya kusave at mm. artists don't have that kipata kijob kikubwa <laughs> then you sit back and you start thinking hey was that a million bucks i just wasted anyway so the same year nikafanya play na, na standing quality sound of music at the national theater yani that year defined my now Everything. my career because from then on i did re- reflections in yeah, kbc that was so good it was a good i joke. loved you it you used to love it <laughs> yeah, yeah 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 i loved it yes. reflections with akina um, eh, chebet na yes, makbu Mac- that was and kamau andongo that was a nice oh, yeah. call that's and then when uh, the producer moved from uh, kbc to citizen yes. we followed with tahidi high yes and then from nimefanya mingi nikaanza kuzikaunt hapa nitaanza ku nini nitaumiza hizi vidole okay yeah. that's how many they are I've, I've, i've been in quite a number good job thank you good job lakini wacha nikwambie bila discipline no you won't bila consistency bila eh, okay talent is important but mm. let me tell you something you may have talent but you may not go far yes you may not go far yes because people are banking on you people are, are, are putting their money on you because understand this mm-hmm. talent we are given everyone of us has Kill a talent like yes. it's the skill set yes. that matters yes. if you're not putting in the work yeah, you yeah. just sit there i'm a talented mm-hmm. actress 
Hiyo ni yako. Me have gone but to a workshop all the way to the US workshop. They are one of the big actors in the US in Miami to learn. You can't stop learning. And then you said something important. You bought your car TV yes. because you needed to continue working on your craft, My craft and the art of saving as an artist. Yes. And then I used to kwanza wacha nikwambia mimi napenda Denzel Washington. I used to just watch it and I'm like, "Oh yeah, goja tuko na simila mtatu." Me too. Denzel. In a progress. Let me tell you something. Have you watched the way that man acts? Yes. Me there's a there's a movie I repeat all the time. Ganio? Unaweza guess? Uh, which one Man on Fire mm-hmm. Tears? Hizi na kuanga kwanza watafanya ya tatu. Equalize. Equalize. <laughs> equalize. <laughs> Just equalize them. Me and Nadia. Yes. Hiyo ni jenga huyo mtu. Yeah, me my my favorite is Man on Fire. Ah. Yes. That's your favorite? Yes, because okay. of his uh, collaboration with Dakota Fanning. That ah, was a... And they're doing a, a new one. They they're doing a two. Oh, when they now they are. Hush. I can't wait. That's a good one. Mimi nataka wafanye equalize mpaka siku ya 10. Mpaka ifike 10. Mpaka ile siku na akae kwa hii dunia for a very long time. My man. Ah. Yes. My man. My man. My man. We were you love is amazing. We were you love Denzel. I love Denzel. So I used to watch and learn how to You know there's a difference between acting for stage, for TV and for film. Yes. Stage is this big. You can do big gestures, you can go crazy. Now this is TV. You slow down. Cuz this is TV. Your gestures are here and there. Yes. Film. It's your eyes. It comes narrowing down like this. And that's a master class I've given somebody. Yes. You're in a master class. Good. Mm. Yeah. I did a master class in Rwanda for Rwandese actors. Oh man. Yeah, yeah. I should brag a little bit. Oh, no, go on, go on. Yeah, it's about allowed. my traveling. No, it's allowed. allowed. Nilifanya <laughs> So first... tumetoka Miami to Rwanda. Oh yeah. Okay. And then Andale. Tanzania nilienda kushuka. Hey! <laughs> oh na huyu na hata sijamaliza. <laughs> Tanzania I went to shoot a BBC TV series my friend. We are sorry. It, don't apologize. <laughs> Mungu akishasema ha ha ngo dio. Anaenda nimekwambia nifungue window na ina. Him back to and above yes, yes. if their neighbors there mm. wanifungue mm. yoyote. Mm. Because the auditions the last two people for that role was me and Lupita Nyong'o. Oh. Sisi ndio tulibaki. Either one will get this role. Nilikuwa Mombasa na Jivinjari, I got that role. I, I almost collapsed because yule mtu alikuwa anapiga Are you sitting down? Nilikaa chini. You got the role. Hey, that's when I made my first million. Hapo ndipo shosho yangu nilimwekea stima. Nikamnunulia carpet mpaka ya bedroom, nikamnunulia fridge kwa sababu she is diabetic, nikamwe ndio aikange dawa yake pale. Yes, my first it's possible. Yes. But always remember give back. Rudi nyumbani, ama you know tithing. If you're a tither, tithe. If somebody who brought you up, enda rudisha oh, mkono. Cuz they do. They, they bless you. you. They bless you. Yes. You will never ndio kuna kwa ups and downs za my industry, but you will never ever lack. You will constantly have you will gigs. constantly there's always something wakati acting gigs are not there i host karaoke that's how i met her yeah she got me a gig in kitengela to host karaoke and since then you see those those um those relationships you build yes good relationships they keep pile, building yes. on each other good, building on each good, other good, good, good relationships. relationships i said good relationships yes, because i have been through those relationships what you get close to love life kidogo yes kabla <laughs> tuingie love life because uh, i know that's another chapter, chapter. allow me to address colorism yes um because you've said you could not even get roles yes because of your skin tone yes and i've seen some also the same maybe comments on social media other yeah. actors claiming you know they could not get roles because uh, maybe walk us through that yeah. and how you were able to remain confident mm-hmm. even when you knew some people were saying you were too dark for a particular scene yes like you see that advert ya kwanza nifanya always yes I, you know, it's not always it's the jig ad. Mm. Just jig it. I know people still remember that ad. Yeah. It was we still did me and the same character I did with the always one. Yeah. It's like we always blended. But here's the thing. <laughs> I I was the one who was being told what to do because this doesn't the color it doesn't sell. So she is so good. She is really good. We can't get rid of her. She's disciplined. She's come for the auditions at the right time. We've called her for the shortlist. She's she whatever we needed her to do, she's done. But uh she can't be the selling point of our product. Because uh tunataka kitu ambayo inapendeza. Even in Tahiti, let me tell you. 
<laughs> the producer used to tell me, ah, bring me yellow, yellow. You know, when you're told that and you're dark and you're the one who's told to cast, you start realizing, oh, this is the reason. So what you do, you work even harder. You don't need to give me that nini, that uh, main character. But the character you give me, I will kill take it. it and I will run with it. And people will still be talking about Lydia Gitashu as that character. Yes. Because I have put my every... I will work double twice. Mm. Yeah. And then the funny thing is that these people that you try to, you know, you're putting them on a pedestal. Yes. They let you down big time. Yeah, they big time. Mm. Mm. I, 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 I don't want to talk about it because you, you know these yes, things. I know. Yeah. yeah. You know mm. what has been happening with yeah. Tahidi yes. and all this stuff. Mm. I don't want to mention names. Yes. But they will let you down. See, because you put them on a pedestal. You made them feel like yeah, they were more special. important than the other yeah, people. You're special. And that can demean somebody. But I tell you something, you keep working at yourself. Work even twice as hard. There is one day. When you are BBC, how did I get it? And me, let me tell you, international stuff when you used to come. I just used to go and audition and go, yeah, that's the one we want. So God has a way of equalizing as well. Yes. When oh. stuff comes from outside. Yes. I've done a Japanese movie. Yes. I have done BBC. Mm. I have traveled to the UK, Marahao. Makato. The three times. Yes. The three. First time I went for the premiere of that TV series yes. called Taking the Flag. Yeah. Then the second time, when I was there, when I was in the UK, somebody, uh, uh, one of my fellow actors, his friend was casting for a play. Yes. He came to see me when I was staying at my producer's. Can I be, uh, I'll come next year, um, see whether we can bring you here yeah. for a play. Yeah. 2010, I went back to the UK. 2009, I went to the UK. Mm. 2010, I went to the UK. To do a play mm. where I was acting as a 14-year-old boy. Yeah, can I go here? Don't joke with talent. No. Nini, shukwatu zile nini zina kangaka dreadlock. Because it's a story about two boys. Yes. And their friendship and yes. how it was affected during the yeah. Mau Mau era. Oh, okay. It's called Burn My Heart. Yeah. Nika zunguka UK na nika ingia pia, inaitawa nini Scotland. Mm. The UK and parts of Scotland. Mm. Acting. Yes. Then nika rudi. And I acted on this. I don't want to look like I'm bragging, but I have to be proud of myself. Yeah. Sometimes you you pinch yourself, you're like, you've actually done all that, haven't yeah. you? Because I went again to do, to act on the Globe Shakespeare Theatre. Hapata Denzel Every actor who loves being on stage wants to act on that Globe Shakespeare. I have acted on that stage. Yeah. Yes. Congratulations, Lydia. Own yeah. it. Because you see, own <sighs> it. Because you see, this is the thing I keep saying. Yes. Sometimes you do not want to clap for yourself because you're scared some people will say you are flossing, you are boasting. Yes. But you've worked hard. Oh, I have. You've worked and hard. And I still am. And you are still working hard. I will stop hard. working hard the way, the day I'll mm. be going, Nikie kwa six feet under. You will That's when I will stop. Yes. Yeah. All Working right. will continue. Yes. Yes. We appreciate it. Mm -hmm. Now, if you could briefly walk us through your life. Of life. <laughs> Me, I'm interested in the part you skip the minji minjis <laughs> all the way to your man at the moment. Ah, I yes. am really interested in that part. So maybe mm -hmm. if you could walk us through your love life, yes. the challenges, yeah. and dating complicated personalities yeah. to settling down mm -hmm. with your husband. Yes. Hey. Let me say, now when I was in my 20s, yeah, early 20s, 21 and below, eh, yeah. now, the, the, not much, that's this is child's play. Yes. But now when you get into, the first serious relationship I got into was with an Austrian. Wazugu walikuwa na nipeda, hii kara, this karalism, hile inatukiwa pale, on the other side, inapendwa sana, this other one, lakini I was very slim, yes. they like them slim, and dark, and beautiful, you have to be beautiful, yes. okay, some of them are not. Yeah, yeah, just realize as long as you're dark and whatever they, but then walikuwa na nipenda yes. And then in the industry, you meet with a, a lot of whites. They're the ones who own the industry mm. in terms of film, stage, whatever. So you mingle with them a lot. So wakwanza nikuwa Austrian. Sit up a club with Maria Teriante, Liz Njaga, to go south, south B, a club, Kachoi, south B. Yeah. We're dancing, we're dancing. And then kamzungu kana niangalia tu. <laughs> and then in a funny way, see me in Angadia, so I turn. I'm like, it can't be me. I'm not. I'm not. Hey, how yes. can I be your type? But yes. I don't know that. Like, how can I be your type? So I'm thinking it's Liz or whoever else that they're interested in. So I'm dancing, dancing. Then we choke up. Then we make a chini. So we make a cup reds. That was my drink. Then song again, I could. I'm telling me, I love dancing. Yeah, I really do. It, it's kept me a bit trim mm. all my life. Yes. So the dance. Nikaona ana nikuji ana dance out of tune. Like ni akwa me kujani. Hi. Hi. 
he Austrian accent. I'm like, eh, okay. Ninaenda kukaa tena anambia, can I buy you a drink? I'm like, me, okay. So nikaenda and then nika make sure amekana au made mwingine because it can't be me. Yes. You doubt it can't be me. Yeah. Literally when I got the drink, I went to the ni ni njoni mwache akatiane huko. Alinifuata mbio huko. I was like, oh, so it's me. Okay. Okay. So when I unapata kaka kwa vile zake actually it's me. It's yeah. it was really good looking. Yes. Mm. 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 Uh-huh. Hapo abaya Yes. on the face yours yes. and unaona ni mtu ameyameji tons of vizuri that i used to live in his sleep that night he had a pajero eh uh, mimi nikienda home kama can i pay a taxi for you where you live i drop you kama okay sasa wewe unataka kwenda isli huu ni mzungu ataenda isli could drop yeah i drop you na kanipeleka home and he took my number but i was like mm, i know you not called but at least i had a good time today yes. yeah. and then he left yeah the next day he calls I'm like, where? Where? Hello. Teacher, are you free today? That time I used to go to college. Nilikuwa pale KC, I had enrolled for evening classes. Kid you me. I told you I love accounts. There you go. Yeah. And you did something like, about it. Nakisoma unaweza soma anytime. Yes. Yeah, even on your 70 if you feel like you want to go to school, go. 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 So, akaniambia, what time your class finish? Kaambia 8. I'll be there to pick you up. Nikapelekwa Westrad. Ha, nikakula Indian. I was like, "Hey, yeah, this can be a life. This is this is good. This is good." Kapeleko. Then Karudishwa home. Then after two days, I can't pick you. I can nipeleka Aga Khan tuangaliwe kama tuko sawa HIV. I, I did mind that mm. actually. Mm. But wote nikwambi because siko ni mwaipi mo. Mpaka wakinipima roka niambia, "Eh, eh, eh, breathe. Breathe. You got to go. Do go." Guku kuna chapa kuna chapa huyu ataanguka you will faint bana do you need a soda to come down I was like no let me just breathe then he came negative yes. so now we started dating properly mm. oh that one anganiambia can i propose and marry you would i would have i would have because i was treated like a queen then because mungu pia na kwanga na plans zake you can look at it negatively or positively he was transferred to uganda okay And that's it. Yes. So one day he invited me for dinner he told me uh, I have some news. I'm going to Uganda. Nilili, I think I was already in love. And that's when I started actually protecting my heart. Cuz nilikuwa nimeanguka hapa mmm. Finished. He wrote me here hapa ndio iko. Then he told me I was I cried. I cried and said, "No, you'll be coming to see me. You know, he's trying to encourage me nini nini." And then he gave me 10k to do a play. I was doing a one woman play at the um, Alliance. Please tell me you'll do that again for us. What? A one woman. Let any sponsorship nifanye. Uh, where's what we wanna watch? But I mean I want to Let laugh like this. Let any sponsorship nifanye. No, there we I want to laugh like this again. Ah, yeah. Yes. Yeah, me performance. Do, do it. Any sponsor I. They, they will do it. They yeah, will come. Yeah. Yes. I will do it. Yeah. So then I perform then he left on the day I was opening. My opening night. He left. Then after like three weeks he got sometimes I'm yeah, I'm heartbroken. I daddy muru wa ruwa was sick. Was sick. Where will I get another one like this? Nili pale kwa mpaka Masai Mara I forgot to tell you. Yeah, ni kwa na nipeleka everywhere. Sasa ameenda. And you know I had heard about Uganda women. Oh, that's why your husband goes there. She talk about na maisha yako. Just move on slowly with your life. Yeah, get yourself organized. Demon. Move on. Accept and move on. Yeah, so I went once to Uganda to visit him. Uh-huh. And after that I knew ah, uh, he meisha. Cuz I saw those women. See, meisha imeenda. Yeah, yeah. Imeenda. That one has gone. Imeenda. But to be honest, <laughs> he was never the marrying time. He, he was never to mm. even up to date. We are friends somehow. Oh yeah. He's he's, he's not, not the settling the down time. time. No. Uh-huh. So it was okay. Yes. So, nimekaa, nimeanza ku heal. There is the second one. We all in Pata Phoenix that time now I used to act at Phoenix players. Yeah. But this day I had gone to watch a play. Nilikuwa nimeenda ku watch play sio ku act. I was not on stage on stage. And what used to happen if you're an actor at Phoenix because mm-hmm. they never used to pay as yeah. much. They just used to give you an appreciation. Ndio mm-hmm. tunakurudishia fair. So if you wanted to go and watch a play they would allow you to go. So I've gone to watch a play and then a friend of mine called Jack has come with their housemate. They were living in South Sea. So we are there we are waiting and then we go in to watch a show. Then half time But when I was uh, kwa nini kwa auditorium watching the play you can tell somebody is looking at you by though so you turn and then he turns and looks 
Like, just like in the movies. Yeah. Just like in the movies. That's yeah. how it was happening. Because I, I could see Jack, Jack, and, hey, there's a disturbance. Half yes. kuna kitu yes. yes. So we went for half time. They came, the three of them. I mean, the two of them. So mm. they came where I was standing, having a soda. And like, ah, lady, I want to introduce you to my friend. This is Jason. We live in South Sydney. And I was like, oh, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Um, then, uh, and I'm here, yeah, we'll talk later. Then Jack came and told me, what are your plans after this? You're yes. being taken for dinner. I was like, yes. <laughs> Why? I said, you know, I think he likes you. It's like, he doesn't have a girlfriend. He doesn't have somebody. No, we live, they just broke up with the girlfriend. I was like, oh, okay, at least he's free. And I build somehow so yes. I can I can accommodate. Yeah. Nikapeleko Trattoria. Tony to Kakula. 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 Love ni kapewa nini. Pesa ni kalipua taxi. Let him maybe don't give me, just pay this guy, he'll take me home. Nika and after two days, dating in Meanza. Okay. We have started dating for three years. We are almost getting married. I tell you to home. Because we don't like relationships that are not going anywhere. As in a, I go as into in a it. Direction. Yeah. I go into it knowing mm. I'll give my all. Yes. Uh, lakini roho yangu nilikuwa nimeanza ku protect kidogo yes. sasa after yes. after Austria. Yeah. Uh, this was America. Yeah. Kaona protect it. Yes. For 3 years. Yeah. Do you know how we broke up? Mm -hmm. After 3 years, we were living together in South Sea. To that time Mungu amelikuwa ame bless nilikuwa nimefanya kazi mpaka nilikuwa nimenua gari. So he's the one kwanza it was a shift, you know, gear. Me I was not very confused. I used to give him to drive. To me end a wedding here, my childhood friend in Thika. Kumbe used to be, he was an alcoholic. Me, I don't know. I grew up watching my uncle. I grew up around alcohol. So you, is that a sickness or it's mm. daily life? Yes. Kumbe it's a sickness and mm. the, he was taking it very seriously. Mm. Iyo siku wali kunywa na my cousin. I have a pointy cousin. Wali kunywa. And me, I can't drive. He was saying, you're going to have to drive this kind of... I, I don't know how to drive. Siku wana confidence. Ni yako gari do? Ni yangu. Oh. Eh. Maji na mimi ni likuwa napia mzungu pesa. Kari gani? Iko nini? <laughs> Don't think at what? I think they're the ones who can, they're the ones who will finance you. No, this one I used to give him money. Eh, hey, Gary, chukua enda, misi na aja nae. Aha. So, <laughs> so uliweka mzungu. Siku, si, 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 kids that needed help. Okay. But you see him financially dependent on that and also yes. helping the kids. Yes. Like yeah. So me that time I was in Tahiti, I was doing other things, films here and there. And my money, I, I used to know how to say in save. And then you remember I did the BBC, yes. so that was an M. Good money. Yes. So I, I was able to take care of myself yes. and part of him. Mm -hmm. yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> I was just trying. Yes. So Yes. So yes. So yes. The nini was somewhere on Thika Road, the evening party. Yeah. I had not given them a present. So I told him, to Kafika, mm. Kambia, let me wait for the bride and groom to come. I tell them congratulations, give them a present, then we can go home. Mm -hmm. Hey, happened to Niliona, the, the, the alcohol and how devilish it can be. He became something else. Is this the same man I know? Can I be you and your friends. They my friends. They don't even know how to keep time. And I was like, it's their day. It's their wedding day. They can do whatever. He started complaining. And as soon as Mwangi, my friend, came and I gave him a present, I was like, let's go. Kari ilikuena and Dasho Nikama tunataka kwenda minguni immediately. And it's a super highway. I kwa imbajengwa to say the super highway. It was that old road. Yes. And then Dasho was like, hey, if I don't see something, I told him, could you please slow down? Shut the name! Hey! You don't kill him! Why do I see you? Why do I see you? Then I saw we are approaching the fire. I told him, could you please stop? I'll take a, I'll take a taxi. I'm like, you want me to stop? You want me to stop? I'm like, you want me to stop? You want me to stop? I'm like, 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 Alisi mama hivi nikiana kufungua mlango akaona ile ni police station alirudi kwa barabara yani kama singe kwa nimeshikilia mlango hivi mimi ningatupa huko nje karudi pa I kept quiet mpaka tukafika South Sea alipoingia kwa nyumba I took I didn't know how to drive I took the keys I told him I'm done you're not going to kill me my okay. grandma I I'm I, I I have a lot of work to do still you will not kill me and that's how we broke up that's how we broke up Then we go to number three. Hey. 
ni mpaka nime sasa ndio nimehama nimeanza kuishi pango i left south sea i took he owed me a lot of money so i took some stuff to cover my yes my <laughs> debts he owed me a lot of money nikabeba vitu vingine za uzungu uzungu sasa baka uweka uzungu eh aliwekwa aliwekwa somehow so sasa nimehamia pango we are living with my workmate then we got a two bedroom house in fact most of the hid guys used to live in that building mm-hmm. so tukaenda na tukaanza life yani jokes za Mungu azikuangi jokes na nilikuwa nishamwambia sasa wacha nipone mm. in december yani nimetoka huku eh, october december uh, mimi ni malala kwa bedroom my roommate is coming tell me eh, but there somebody even how she had broken up so we were healing yes. tulikuwa hiyo oh, ilikuwa ni yeah. nini mm. nitaanga kwa rehab center ya kupona mm. roho zimevunjwa mm. <laughs> she gets called by her friend eh uko wapi But hey, I have a mzungu friend of mine nataka kuja tukupeleke out. She comes and calls me mimi nimelala. Ni dia tunapeleka out leo. Mimi mm. kaambia, "Ai, did you first of all say I'm mzungu? I don't want that nonsense. Mimi mistake mchezo. I'm, uh, uh, I'm sleeping and I'm sleeping. No." Sane. Idia. Uh friends have arrived. I don't uh, what do you mean friends? Me I don't know these people. Kaambia, "No, just open." nikafungua nikasema let me just say hi. Nikapata Brad Pitt amekaa kwa kiti. Eh? Have you done Have you ever done a double take? Unaangalia about the did I see right? Where? Yani he was really handsome. Good looking. Match of blue. Blonde hair. Nice. Build. Kwa sababu alikuwa amevaa mangina so tattoos look like here. Yes. Yes. Kumbuka, roho yako ijapona kabisa. Yes. Hii wachana nayo. Eh hey, let me tell you I told you about instinct from the beginning. Yes. When you listen to your instinct, danganyangi kwanza especially women, your instinct doesn't lie. I, I don't know about how the male works instinct wise, but I have I've always now learned to listen to my instinct. Nikisikia a a hapa sitapita. Ama mm. Wacha niende an hour later. Yes. Always listen to that because it's telling it's giving it's like a, a warning quietly like kwambia red flag red flag. Then you're like me come no uh, you guys go we maybe tomorrow i don't feel it alikuja mmoja kaniambia come on the way here wa 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 go 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 who nikaongelesha mkae kwa like okay yes. let me shower nikaingia shower tukaenda tao cocktails a cocktail bar that time and then i met my fellow artists yeah. Warning sign red flag number 2. Nikaona anaanza ku have conversation with one of my fellow actors. I was like, what am I doing here? He said he looked like he was interested in me. What am I doing here? But maybe I also know that I, I'm still healing, so I'm not 100% mm. present. Nilijificha, nikawaacha, mimi nikarudi huko na nikalala. Satisa. Why did you leave? And I was like, no, I thought you got interested in somebody else. I'm like, oh, uh, come on. Eh that's a relationship I should never have gotten into so how they i left in the city room me i slept the next day ndio wa mashikana they've gone to nairobi west he took me to nairobi west a lot kukula gizards mm. but he was a uh, wale watu wanaweza kunywa crete mzima ni irish american mm. no irish american yes. yeah they even have it's called st patrick's day ni mm. how let me tell you mm-hmm. for five years on and off i dated this man but the day I, i will not go into all the details the okay. day i left i, I said enough because he used to have domestic violence mm-hmm. emotional abuse financial abuse unajua wale dangling a carrot if you don't do this hivi ushinde kama unarukia hivi he was that mm-hmm. but the day i said ah ah huyu ah, ah, hapana huyu ataniua he almost threw me off the balcony fifth floor tukishi pango fifth floor He used to be violent. The first time he was like that I was mm. like he came with flowers the next day. He cooked for me. He was a very good cook. Mm. I can't let her flowers. I can't let her chocolates. I'm so sorry it will never happen again. He grew up watching his father beating on his mom. So your tabia akaichukua. And he told me himself. So I remember Lydia people don't change. People don't change. Ile time alikugonga kwanza ndio ukasema No, I can't have this. So by the time I was saying enough I was almost being thrown off the balcony of the fifth floor and I could see the car where I would have hit nani manisike. So I told him the thing that stopped him was I told him 
Once you're done killing me, please go to my, my he loved my grandmother. Once you're done killing me, go and tell my grandmother what you have done. So she doesn't spend the rest of her life, however long she live, asking questions. Just let her be comfortable with That's when he came back. Can you tell Then he had bad for. Alikuwa kuangusha. Nilikuwa, where? Wata nikuwa mbio, unuona apa? Ninyuele ili grow. In braids, he used to pull pakas in angoka. Mm. And then he was very careful not to touch the money maker here. Oh, Haguzi makofi, yes. huko ndiyo, eh, we are in the kazi, tunataka watu wa sijue. He alienated me from family, from friends. My friends in Bango used to tell me, uh, let me tell you, we'll come to your barrio. Because clearly, you like what is happening to you. Very good at alienating, that's narcissists. Yeah. So when you, let me, this is my advice. The first time you feel, Asha, no, this is not going to be good. Please, that's when you stop. Don't wait for a, the shenanigans to come mm. in. Just quit that relationship. Mm. Quit. Mm. Yeah. Oh. But right now, <laughs> 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 and then <laughs> when I was with this one who used to beat me up, there was a um, um, a chama mm. we had opened in uh, Pango. It was yes. called Roots Welfare Group. So this man used to just observe me. I ngalia from a distance. Sasa aka kana jobla na kapenda. Aka. Sasa kana chapo chapo aje apa. Aya. Kone aka. Uyu mtu maze uyu mtu si atoke kwa hii story. Atoke kwa hii story aone vile nitahuria hii very quickly. The day he saw me ni kwa peke yangu. Aniambia, wewe unajua nimekuwa nikikungoja for how long? Wewe you you are your my wife. Do you know that? You are my wife. That's 10 about 11 years ago. You are happy now? Yes. Alikuwa na ngojanga in the periphery. The day this guy will make a mistake. And she says she's cleaned her hands because it was five years of on and off. I'm taking so he charge. Used, yeah. He used to observe. Manaume aki decide. He, he, he. He ni angu. Yeah. And that is 11, almost 11 years ago. He's a darling. You had, you noticed him? No. Because since it nenda chama, watu natuwa pesa, tunakula nyama, nini nini. Because I was so, my nini was this way because of that white man. Mm. It was this way. So then when he left, that's when even people around me could tell, mm. now she's thriving. Because that nini, your self-esteem is kanyagwad. Kanyagwad is trampled on his, hey, ungekuja kwa hiyo nyumba yetu ilikuwa naishi na hiyo mzungu. Ilikuwa nga nama nini on the walls. Alikuwa na punch walls. Eh, hacha u Brad Pittness for what? For who? For why? Eh, wacha nika na mnyeri wangu please. Nikuwa da, na hai. For what? Takufa bana. Ah ah. You'll die. Muga. <laughs> you will die. I'm telling you. Hi. <laughs> you remember to kata kata to kule? Where? No. Be very careful. So exit Brad Pitt. Exit Brad Pitt and forever, forever and ever. Mm. Introducing Nyeri. Na ito akefanya gashari. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Kibanya kashare, na tunasonga na life. Iki tupeleka hivi tunanda na hivi. Yes. Kwa mana mimi, he has allowed me to thrive. He's not jealous. That guy used to be jealous when I'm hosting karaoke. In fact, there's somebody who watched my story somewhere and she said, I remember when you were hosting karaoke in town. I was hosting karaoke in Club Sevens. And he would come and then he would just be so abusive. Mm. Verbo now. Calling me all those, you know those bad words? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Ah, then the person to anyone who can be sweet you can't be. He? Na vinyo ana semanga wa Kenyan men are not romantic. Ah, kwenye ni uko. Huh? Ask me. Muzungu na kupunch in the gut because ataki sura yako yaribike. Where di kwada? Where? Everyone. Where? <laughs> no. Yeah. Listen to your instinct. Yes. Because it tells you this. He he hate enda vizuri. Eh. Honestly, we have that thing. Because from the first day I met him, that thing. There was that thing. I didn't listen to that voice. Your intuition. I should have. You should have. I should have. How is marriage life? Ups and downs. Yes. But mostly ups. I love that. Ups and downs. downs. Yes. But See, mostly... I have... if, watch and me. if you come here and tell me that your marriage is new. Watch a wongo. In which world? What are you talking about? 
Two people who are not one of the same uh, parents, a muta korofana, hapa na hapa. Yeah. Here and there. Eh. But it's how you na navigate eh. through all those. Mm. Yeah. So that when you're up, maintain that up as long. But like, you're down. Embrace it. And mostly, me, I'm going to tell you. I'm going to let you down. I accept myself. Because me, I'm going to tell you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Season is really when I'm going to tell you. Okay. Yeah. He, he. Uh, by the time I see him angry, it has taken him, I, uh, it takes so much for yes. him to get angry. Mm. But even me, I try my best not mm. to get him angry. Mm. But you'll find somewhere along the way, you may find a kid Yes. And I'll call that. Hmm. And then he's, he's a gentleman. Very cool, oh. calm. Me, the best thing that is, when the Nihal in particular confidence, he could drive. I look on particular. Nana Kai, have you ever been trained? I mean, been trained to drive yeah. or retrained? Because I had, I used to know, but then yes. when I got into an accident, nikapata mm. <laughs> panic attacks, ni 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 ni. Kuna siku moja, hmm. tunaenda kwa shosho yangu. Alienda kafika maani, mm. eh, akaeka gari kando, akatoka kaniambia, enda, ngi hapa. I'm like, hmm, hmm. No, I started shaking immediately, I was like, what, what? Ah, Nini, well, Kitaka Kwenda to Gong when I woke away to end. And he got into the passenger seat and he slept. Have you ever seen somebody? I'm ready to die with you if you. Nakini Gari Lota and Desha. Nanili and Desha Mpaka Gataga from Pango. Confidence. He gave me that confidence because I used to have panic attacks. Yes. I have a car but I can't drive. Mm. Now I drive like a. Says Namimi Ukumama 3. Nakuanga Patodie. You drive Wende. like Joshua. Yes. Okay. Hey. It's Osio. Eh, hey, Osio. Mm. Hey, Kai. Hey, hey, hey. He gave me the confidence. Yes. Does mm. he support your craft and what's the importance of having a spouse that supports your art? I'm telling you, he has let me thrive. Mm. There's nothing as good as having that support system from your spouse. When You know, the job that I do is in the limelight. Yes. Most men would not be happy about that. Him, he says, keep going. Keep going. I started a YouTube channel. He's a support. He sometimes when he's available, he'll come at the camera. Oh, he. Support system. He. He's not jealous. That, that I, yani, I thank God for that one. He is not jealous. At, he wants you to keep thriving. Mali siu kosaniya ni wakati mungina ke anza kuniambi ya tetana. Gere to fresh haki nusaidi na to fresh. Not really. Mm. We share responsibilities. Oh, okay. Um, yes. But responsibility yako ni yako. Na yangu ni yangu. Because uh. kila mtu wanafanya what they, they are supposed to do. Yes. Sasa ukianza, wawo ukiona ati, eh, hey, imuwezi lazima, lami utakuwama, unanza kuniambe nifanya responsibility uh -uh. yako. Tutakorofana. Yeah. How do you work with your It won't work. Yeah. Yes. Because it's like, you have to eat food in your house. You have to eat trash, everything taken care of. Yes. Now you have to eat your house. Good. You know? Na maji, na na whatever, maji. na steamer. Steamer to share, I don't mind. Yes. But what I'm saying is, I'm going to eat your house, and I'm going to eat your house, and I'm going to eat your house. It won't work. No, it can't. Yes. And you should not allow that to happen. Mm. I would advise that. Mm. Unless, literally, you can see, mm. You can actually be able to take care of it. Yes. And it becomes a loan. Yes. Like in Once you give your spouse a loan, it's like giving you your parents, like giving <laughs> you a mom a loan. You know? Exactly. It's like, I need to be a It will never come Just back. say, bless you, Mungu. Yes. Barikiyo. Yes. yes. Let me touch on the creative industry for our Nini Kidogo. For a bit, yes. Yes, for a mm. bit. Yeah? Mm. I've, I've had, especially on the music industry, mm -hmm. maybe you can now answer collectively since you are creative. Yes. I see a lot of comments and they break my heart. Yeah. Oh, Kenyan artists are not doing this. Oh, to me, she to me, Oh, our creative industry, now mm -hmm. Okay, what do we need to do? And what are your observations when it comes to our creative industry? And you, do you feel the support from the local people? Mm -hmm. Do you feel supported mm -hmm. by Kenya? Honestly, mm. me, I know I have my fan base. I feel supported. Good. People have been following my career. Yes. Because I, I, I used to watch you in reflections. I used to have come on stage. Oh, you came to our school. So, yeah, people have been following. Yeah. We have fans. Mm -hmm. The only problem is, do you, have you maintained your consistency? Do we see your growth? Ume grow. Amoko tu pale pale. 
Like for some of my fellow actors in Tahiti, you ask yourself, what happened? Your graph should be going up. Not, yes, we understand there are times when uh, we have downtime as yes. actors, hakuna ma jobs. Mm. But it doesn't mean you stop creating. Like now you see this YouTube channel that I started, it's something else that once it becomes one, it should be bringing yes. extra Correct. income. You don't, usilale. You cannot sleep and, and start complaining about, oh, the government is not doing. Me, the only place I can talk about the government is Prisk. I'm a member of Prisk. Mm. They're supposed to collect royalties on our behalf. But then, since we we shot ourselves in the foot. Mm. We chaguad leaders who are just uh, ubinafsi. Mm. They were just looking out for themselves. In the meantime, me, I'll keep working. Yeah. Whenever I have a job, right now, see, it's Kina. I'll keep Congratulations. working. Congratulations. Thank you. You are Until killing. Until <laughs> This one is your greatest. This one ah, here. Ah, nice. <laughs> yes. I am no, but we gotta give it to Kina. It's an amazing, it's an amazing, it's an amazing show. show. That oh, one yeah. you have to give it And to I them. have to say thank you to Zamaradi. Yes. Because they put us on a very good platform. Mm. We get paid salaries. So finally, you're being appreciated. Yes. Even though it's a contract, because it comes a one-year contract, yes. you get your salary every, yeah, every, month. every month. That's a job. Good. This is not a hobby. It's a job. And don't nobody play with me. Yes. Don't play with me, man. Don't play with my talent. I'm working. Yes. God yes. damn it, I'm working. God damn. <laughs> I'm able to pay my bills. Yes. I'm able to save. I'm in a circle. I'm a board member of a circle. That's another income. Oh. Watch and I'm going to be a Timbuktu. <laughs> and you thank God. Yes. Yes. God, I am so proud of you. I, I, I think you've mentioned your YouTube channel. It's been running on our uh, screen, yes. even as we speak. Uh, yeah. I want to touch on your YouTube channel because I want my people to come yes, and give you crazy love right oh, there. Yeah, please, please. Yes. <laughs> but before I go there, yeah. Lydia, I want to give you an opportunity to walk us through four things uh, yeah. that you think uh, have kept you in yeah. this industry. Yeah. Four key tips yeah. that anyone watching you right now, and they are not even in the creative industry, because yeah. you know, tips sometimes, no matter where you are, they come in handy. Yeah. Give us four things yeah. that you think would greatly help us advance our craft or yeah. make us better in our jobs. Okay. The first thing I'll say is prayers. And not just for yourself. If you have, let me tell you, my grandmother prays for me. So I have a prayer circle that always prays for that success to happen. Yes. And how do you get people to always pray for you? You also don't forget them. Every month I make sure that I go to my grandma yeah. and I make sure she is fine. She is fine. You know what I mean by fine? Ukosi chakula, ukosi something in your pocket. You're fine. Mm. The prayers that come with that. And even my, my the rest of my family, they can be a witness that I really do my best. Mm. It's not like the money that I make mm. is for me. Mm. I spread it around. Mm. That's number one, prayers. Mm. Number two, you have to be consistent. See at Leo, uh, kwa this show, the next time, which, what are you? Define yourself. Mm -hmm. Mimi, I'm a creative entrepreneur. I can always be called to direct a play. I can be called to act. I can be called to do a TV commercial. That's, I'm a creative give entrepreneur. A Define class. yourself. Mm -hmm. uh, give a masterclass mm -hmm. on performance yes. because I have been at it more than 20 years. Mm -hmm. This is my 23rd year mm -hmm. in that industry. Yeah. Yes. You have to be very hardworking. Very hard working. Please, you can't sit back and say, see, Nicole, mini redemptor. I, I don't need to do anything else. I still go for auditions elsewhere. I did like a small movie the other day. It's a short film. It's, it's called Ziwa. It was just being launched. It, it, when I show you a Fespako. Mm. You know, that's a very big uh, mm. film festival. Yes. Yeah. You, you don't stop. Don't, don't be complacent. Ah, see, me in Metrosheka and redemptor. No. So you see, I'm still doing YouTube. Any, if I get a chance to audition or do a film here and there, I will do it. Yeah. And I will do it with all the discipline. This is the number four. God. The discipline that it takes. And in any industry you're in, not just in acting, wherever you are, if you're disciplined, Udai Kosa, because people rely on you. People can count on you. People can bank on you. Ile kitu japata ni endorsement. But it's with the discipline. That discipline they see, see your talent. Mm. I'm telling you, don't, don't rely on your talent. At, you know, I'll sit back at home, somebody will call me. Uh -uh, step out, go out there, look for it. Work hard, keep improving yourself. Mm. I think I've said before, but keep improving yourself. Don't, don't be complacent. Yes, don't, be. don't sit back. Yeah. Keep for, working. Yeah, for anyone watching you and they think maybe I'm not, I'm not meant for that role, I'm too ugly, I'm too dark, I'm too whatever. <laughs> 
utawambia who told you mm. are you the one when you employing yourself mm-hmm. but you am too dark I'm too what mm. go there do your best if it's an audition walk in there confidently leave everything on that sweat everything on that floor yes. and then walk out yeah. confidently yes utapigiwa simu good but if you go there okay, okay if you go doubting yourself yeah okay i can't get a kitu okay we yes then you go there you, you audition shaking shaking where is the confidence yeah people want you want you uh, we want you want us to use you to sell mm. our product mm. show us how you will do it yeah so can i put my name is at the using the camera you, you failed go. already and let me tell you mm. we uh, this is the truth every artist when you're going for an audition there is an adrenaline kuna panic ina kuanga even me who has been there for 23 years when i walk into an audition there is a there is a certain energy If you use it wrongly, utapata your audition. Mm. But if you use it the right way, you be- take a breath. Yes. Breathe. Yes. And then anza la inzako. Yes. I'm here to tell you that I'm standing here and I'm you're going to give me this job. Yeah. Whatever the lines are that you're supposed to say. Okay. Utatoka hapo na shortlist ama job. Ama job. Eh, Haya. Acha ni good at my. Yes. Sir. Mm. Haya quick fire mm. before you tell us something about your eh, YouTube you're channel. Let me do the fire. What thing a quick fire? Mm. Number one, favorite mm. to pack song. Dear mama to to be a tenor cuz it was it was given it was given when i was young my mama had be 17 years old kicked out on the street but back in the day i never thought i'd see her face in a woman alive that could take my grandma's place yes the other rabbit man copywriting period <laughs> <laughs> Yes, yes. Uh-huh. Uh, I know you say Denzel, my yeah. man, mm. but a uh, favorite female actor. Ah. Uh, uh, Theron. I don't have one. Uh, Those okay. are there's a in English. Yes, yes, Theron. Yes. Uh, there's Julia Roberts. Okay. There's uh, let me say one more. There's there's one who's won. The one who has won. Ay, Viola Davis. Yeah, I know. She so was waiting. And I guess so look how do you forget <laughs> that? Shame on you, shame on you, shame on you, shame on you. <laughs> Viola Davis. Yes. Did you have you watched how to get away with murder? Yeah. That thing when she turned like a messy the, the makeup part yeah. was my favorite when yeah. she stood in that mirror yeah. and akatoa makeup yote akatoa aka and then makeup. she's doing it so deliberately yes this, this. ah that was a good one kulia, katua, a makamasi makamasi kemira na dikora komanya go go watch fences hi and denzel What are you talking about Lily what oh, kitambo okay. Look at this I told you that's my life so yeah, I keep sorry. watching to improve my craft <laughs> I look at I this. watch them to improve my craft <laughs> I think go watch eh hey, locally locally best what best actress best actor cuz in I I mean actor, like, yeah, I female, like the male. whole actress me too yeah it's yes. male act- yes. so female myself <laughs> I want to thank me. <laughs> thank you all so much. I want to thank me for being so good at what I do. But apart from that, yes. it's not just me. <laughs> it's not just me. Yes. But you, um, Caroline Midimo. Okay, that's a good one. Caroline Midimo. That's a good one. She's massive she is massive talent. She is good. Massive talent. Yes. Hey, you lemo, did you watch Kina when it was starting? Mm. She's good. What will say Rika sana wakati she was at her character died. Yes. She's good. good. I find one. her good, yeah. Yes. Really. Male? Male um uh can you call him Mabuki? Yes. Raymond Fuller? <laughs> Raymond Fuller. <laughs> He's got a presence. That man? Yeah. That man? Yes. I look at him and sometimes I wanna say <laughs> Denzel. That's our Kenyan Denzel. You ain't got nothing on Raymond. Mm-hmm. And then I remember I love Denzel too. So, so both of them are these <laughs> so, are Kenyan yes. uh, Kenyan uh, Denzel yes. and uh, that's a, uh-uh. a, Ken, no. a Kenyan uh-huh. Raymond. Uh-huh. A, a US, yeah, Raymond. US Raymond. Yes. That, that's what's up. That's no. it. <laughs> that man I love him. Mm-hmm. I, it was always my dream to have him on the show. Yeah. But he has an Osaka Osaka nini effect like uh, oh. it's very hard to interview and stuff but he's wow. such an amazing man really mm-hmm. that, now that's something he's, i didn't know yeah, about him yeah he's incredible uh, like i i look at him yeah. and the number of years he's been in the industry yeah. his level of discipline mm-hmm. consistency there you go i love i honestly love him yeah. that Fuller. guy should yeah you know, this government should just say yeah, thank you to this man i should have man. a paint of him in my house wow yeah i should, I should add that yeah, and mine as well yeah of course <laughs> 
<laughs> not, I'm true joking, no. not true story. You've done good. Yeah. You've done good. God is great. You've done good. I don't take all the credit. Who you are? No. Punch of course, through, through him, through because him, yeah. of him, mm. you are here. Yeah. And you've been able to bless us with your art, which yeah. is beautiful. Thank but you. But I don't want to let you go before you talk to us about your YouTube channel. Absolutely. Congratulations. Thank you. I keep saying if you are a, a content creator right now. Yes. And you are not using these tools that are available. Mm -hmm. Now we umelala. Can, umelala. Umelala. So congratulations on your channel. Thank you. But tell us what you do there. And yeah. guys, as she's talking to us about it. You know how we do, guys. If you need to post this, go check, subscribe, and then come back well and good. Mm -hmm. But maybe you could tell us so yeah. that I can send my people yes. to your platform. Yes. Our channel is called the Hawa and Gitachu yes. YouTube channel. Maybe tell them who is Hawa. Oh, yeah? Yeah, Hawa. Because they Hawa. know you as Gitachu. Who is oh, yeah. Hawa? Hawa is my partner. In fact, yeah. she's the one who actually introduced me to YouTube. I What are you talking about? I mean, you're talking analog. Me, when you give me a stage, when you give me a, a you know a script, I'm I'm happy. I'm home. But then she she waited for me one day. I was in the U.S. and then when I came back, she came to visit me. She told me there's something I want us to do. You know, YouTube is doing this and this and that. And she introduced me to, and I was like, mm, that's something I can do. And now it's been I joined five months ago. Hawa and Gitashu. Gitashu is um, Hawa is the one who started, yes. and then I joined. So now it became Hawa and Gitashu. Yeah. And there, if you want to, Kwanza Udem, she's really good with inter interior decor. She changed my house. Lin, so, I, I, I don't know how I was living. Yeah. My bedrooms. Yeah. They, mwah, so she can do interior decor stuff. She can revamp your home. Through our channel, look at the palo videos. Yeah. And then because we are an artist, you find so many videos of actors we've invited who have talked a little bit more about stuff that they do, which you do not know. Eh, kama wake money, soon dopata ya karomidimo, kuna estakahuha, wole alikuwa kwa wingula moto. There's quite a lot of videos. We have more than more than 30 videos right now. So we really ask uh, lane people, be a come and be how and gitashi people. Yes. That first of all, to finish your watch time. We are at 2,000, but I'm sure after this video, to take 5,000, 6,000 Yes. Before. You are 500 and something thousand here. <laughs> nah, they wouldn't. They, <laughs> yes. they wouldn't. I, know, I, I know. want them to come and support you. And maybe guys, soon you'll see me on her platform because she's blessed us with this conversation. She's blessed us with beautiful energy. Mm -hmm. So I'm pretty sure even if I go to her channel, me to touch a from here to Timbuk. That's what we like. I hear, I hear what a group of schools they call it Timbuk. Timbuk too. Okay. <laughs> All right. I wanna wind up, my dear. But okay. before I do, yeah. if there's anything you feel like I left out, mm -hmm. let me know. No, I yes. think you have my whole life story in a nutshell. Yes. And I'm so grateful. Thank you for inviting me to this platform. Yeah. I've been waiting. Yes. I was like, all right. It's time. And all things work well. Together yes. for good. Together for good. Yes. So when thank they you for are meant to. Me. Yes. When they are meant to. Absolutely. Social handles. Oh, yeah. Uh, on Facebook, I'm Lydia Gitashu. Yeah. On Instagram, I'm at Lydia Gitashu. On Twitter, Lydia Gitashu. My name is my brand. Yes. So... Okay, type to Lydia Gitashu. Follow me. There's, I'll always remind you of what's happening. You'll always see if there are auditions. Like sometimes people want to audition for something. I usually put on my walls. So, yeah. yeah, follow me on those. Okay. Yes. I appreciate it. I appreciate Guys, you. <laughs> yes, thank you so much. Guys, it's been an amazing show. And thank you so much for tuning in. And I know our guest has blessed us with an amazing conversation. So you are going to do what you need to do. Please go on her platform and subscribe to her channel show her some love and most importantly let me know what you've picked home from today's conversation on the comment section guys you will find her youtube link pinned there please please go show her some love and of course let me know who else would you want to see here on the show and a special thank you to my incredible team who puts this work together i appreciate you and of course if you want to share your story with me my email is right here on the screen and if you want to connect to my guest uh, through her social media handles the details are right here on the screen i hope and guys take care of yourself remember work on your craft consistency prayers hard work and keep innovating guys you know usikai tu hapo keep learning go back to school it's never it's never uh yani akuta time yenye ufai kurudi it's never late 
late. That's the word I was looking for. It's never late for you to go and pursue your craft, right? Improve yourself. Improve yourself. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my name is Lynn Gogi. Till next time, bye-bye.